धन्यवाद गुरुदेव आप लोग कैसे हैं गुरुदेव आप लोगों का बहुत बहुत तह दिल से धन्यवाद गुरुदेव आप लोगों ने जो मेरी पिछली वीडियो को इतना ढेर सारा प्यार दिया मेरी तो आंखें भराई गुरुदेव मगर आंसू पोचने वाली कोई थी नहीं तो खुद ही पोचने पड़े हैश टैग सिंगल मैन मैटर फॉर दो जो नॉमी आई विक्रांत चौहान ए गोल्डन पोस्ट ग्रेड फॉर आईटी एंड करेंटली वर्किंग एज ए रॉकेट साइंटिस्ट एंड इंडियन स्पेस रिसर्च ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द मोस्ट फ्रीक्वेंटली आस क्वेश्चन बी इट फ्रॉम एम टेक आई आई टी और आई आई टी के इन जनरल दीज आर क्वेश्चन कलेक्टेड फ्रॉम माई इंस्टाग्राम और माई लिंकड इन और फ्रॉम माई यूट्यूब हैंडल्स तो गुरुदे शुरू करते हैं आज का कौन बने करोड़पति तो गुरुदे पहला सवाल आप लोगों के कंप्यूटर स्क्रीन के ऊपर ये रहा so the first question is does discrimination happens between the mtech and the btech guys so uh, from the academic point of view or from the professors point of view none such discrimination happens but now coming to the question that does btech publicly humiliate mtech guys or mtech publicly humiliate the btech guys so none of such incidents have happened to my knowledge in iit kanpur but i i have also not experienced such things But B-techs call M-techs matkas in their groups, and M-techs call B-techs bachas in their groups. So that is little bit of uh, things only. And uh, but sub, you might be thinking, wondering that if you have read so much things on Reddit that B-tech and M-tech discriminate between one another and publicly humiliate also. So uh, what is the solution to this problem? So ninety nine point nine nine percent no such problem would occur to you. But the solution to this problem is suppose. a btech electrical guy is humiliating a mtech csc guy so he the mtech csc guy just have to pick up his phone and call one of his friends in mtech electrical once he has called the student in mtech electrical the mtech electrical student must be a must or any of his friend must be a ta in the course taken by that btech electrical guy and once you find a ta of the course in uh, in which the btech electrical guy has enrolled then a ta teaching assistant has approximately 60 to 80% of marks in hands so if a student in electrical wants to pass then all the marks of his are in the hands of the teaching assistant and if the teaching assistant wants then he can you can understand teaching assistant is just below the professor so if the teaching assistant want uh uh mind blast then he can do anything uh in terms of mass so guru there now coming to whether the discrimination happens in uh placements or not so if you are going for specialized roles like os or systems level roles or machine learning level roles or kernel development roles then such discrimination does not happens but if you are going for the graduate level roles like gt or sde profiles then many times discrimination happens and it happens very frequently uh, this is because uh, also if you are going for non technical roles like product management or any other roles then also discrimination might happen and you might face discrimination that btech are being preferred over mtech this is because uh, btech have more experience in iit as compared to mtech because mtech are hold, holding a experience of just one year whereas btech are holding a experience of 3 years so that matters uh, also suppose we are going for a product management role then in those non technical roles all the students of all the branches and all the programs are open uh, it is not like that only csc he people are only open it is for all the profiles all the programs all the students so that is very much problematic thing so now moving on to uh, it does let's see one example whether how much ingrained this discrimination is there or or it's just surface level so uh, let me take example of google india so google had hired 10 students from iit kanpur in 2024 batch two students were having ppo so let's ignore them so total eight students were hired from those eight students two students were from btech csc three students were from btech electrical and one student was from btech chemical now uh, one student was from mtech csc and one student was from mdes Let's ignore MDS profile because uh, it was not SDE profile. Okay, so you can see that uh, only one MTech CSE was hired. But if you see from BTech perspective also, only two BTech CSE students were hired, and rest were from electrical and chemical domains. 
I haven't seen any of the M Tech chemical or M Tech electrical people who are coding very highly that they want to get placed in Google. So, I am very confused about what is the truth of discrimination or what is the truth of discrimination. Because now you can see that the M Tech people are not going to be able to do their strength. The strength of B Tech is not going to be able to do their strength. The strength of B Tech CAC and M Tech CAC is not going to be able to do their strength. The strength of B Tech is 100, the strength of B Tech CAC is 50. So, from 50, one girl has taken the offer of B Tech Google. And from 100, she has taken the offer of B Tech Google. So, the ratio is not going to be able to do their strength. तो इस जो डिस्क्रिमिनेशन है इसको ज़्यादा दिमाग में पालने की ज़रूरत नहीं है क्योंकि अगर आप एनवीडिया और पॉलकॉम और एंटेल जैसी हार्डवेयर प्रोफाइल या या बहुत ही इंटेंस रिसर्च टाइप प्रोफाइल्स को देखेंगे तो वहाँ पे आपको ज़्यादा एमटेक्स और एमएसआर स्टूडेंट्स मिलेंगे एस कंपेयर एट्टी वन लैक्स का तो हमारा हाईएस्ट पैकेज था ही एमटेक सीएसी का तो उसी को दिमाग में रखते हुए चलिए नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन पे मूव करते हैं सो गुरुदेव इस नाउ मूविंग ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सो द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इस इस जेंडर रेशियो क्वाइट बैड इन एमटेक सीएसी और एमटेक ओवरऑल सो या आई वुड से इट इज क्वाइट ट्रू ओनली बिकॉज इन एमटेक सीएसी इन माय बैच एंड ऑल्सो द जूनियर बैच द जेंडर रेशियो वाज क्वाइट बैड फॉर एग्जांपल इन आर बैच देयर वर 50 बॉयज एंड जस्ट 5 गर्ल्स बट इफ यू सी फ्रॉम इलेक्ट्रिकल देयर वर there was matchable ratio so uh, and also in bsb department also there was matchable ratio but for cac i don't know there is some curse or what i don't know so now moving on to the next question uh, is 1 crore like packages a reality for mtech guys or not and such companies open for mtech cac people or not so such companies are mostly hfts high frequency trading firms and mostly they don't open for uh, mtech cac uh, they mostly open for M B Tech C A C and also B Tech Electrical with very high top J ranks only. So uh, if you are aiming for only one crore packages and those things, uh, then you might be disheartened. So don't get disheartened. There are you can target for seventy to eighty lakhs companies that those come those are open for M Tech C A C guys. For example, our uh, batch highest placement was eighty one lakhs. So you can dream for such large large packages but if you are aiming for just one crore domestic package then you might get disheartened or if you are then you will come to your eyes that if you don't get a job or a job then what will you do with IIT? So don't think about it, just give your best and forget the rest. Gurdjieff, let's not talk about internship opportunities at IIT Kanpur. So from my batch, none of the students had gone for internship and from, but my from senior batch and from my junior batch, some students had gone for internships. Uh, internships typically happen during the summer term. So what is exactly a summer term? Your first semester starts from uh, August to December and the second semester starts from January to May. From May ending to July, there is a two to 2.5 months of gap. In that gap, you can uh, pursue any of the internship opportunities if your CC supervisor allowed, allows you. But uh, from if you ask my perspective, you shouldn't go for internship, especially for uh, IIT Kanpur. And also, uh, mostly IIT Madras pushes the students to go for internship. Uh, other IITs, I don't know much about them, whether they uh, push the students for going to the internship. This is because uh, actually, you have only those two months to focus on your thesis. Actually, what happens is that now after all, from September to December time, you your total focus is towards the preparation of your placement. And, and during that time, you can't focus on your thesis. But if you don't focus on your thesis, then supervisor will, will ask for your work. काम दे काम भाई मेरे को काम दे मैं ऐसे मांगेगा काम कि काम दो भाई मेरे को बढ़ना मैं तुम्हें जयमाता दिख रही हूँ भाई तो उस टाइम आप काम भी नहीं कर सकते तो और ऊपर से आप इंटर्नशिप भी चले गए थे तो उस टाइम भी आप उतना कुछ खास काम नहीं कर पाएंगे तो जो ये जुलाई मई से लेके जुलाई तक का टाइम कि मास मई से लेके जुलाई तक अपना थीसिस और अपने प्लेसमेंट प्रिपरेशन पे ध्यान देना चाहिए जो सितंबर से स्टार्ट होने वाला है तो मेरी एडवाइस तो यही रहेगी कि बुलाती है इंटर्नशिप अपॉर्चुनिटी मगर जाने का नहीं गुरुदेव मगर 
बाकी आप दूसरे सीनियर्स के भी एक्सपीरियंसेस ले सकते हैं और तब आप डिसीजन ले सकते हैं कि आपको जाना चाहिए इंटर्नशिप पे या नहीं जाना चाहिए ये मेरा एक्सपीरियंस है तो मैं अपना एक्सपीरियंस शेयर कर रहा हूँ तो भाई नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन है हमारा वेदर द प्लेसमेंट ऑफ नॉन सी एस ब्रांचेस आल्सो एज ग्रेट एज सी ब्रांचेस सो नो नॉट दैट मच ग्रेट बट ओके ओके इन नेचर सो एंड द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज आर द नॉन सी एस सी स्टूडेंट अलाउड फॉर सी एस प्लेसमेंट सो ये नॉन सी एस सी स्टूडेंट आर वेरी मच अलाउड फॉर सी एस सी प्लेसमेंट बट फॉर ए वेरी मच लिमिटेड कंपनीज एंड इन दो लिमिटेड कंपनीज all the branches are allowed and all the programs are allowed so it becomes very much competitive in nature so you must take care of those things as well magar jab yaar pyar kiya to darna kya aur jab naukri chahiye to fir kya load lena fir to chahiye hi chahiye now the next question is are the girls allowed in boys hostel in the public places only or in all the places so in iit kanpur girls are allowed in boys hostel and boys are allowed in girls hostel from morning 6 am to midnight 12 okay everywhere everywhere you can go freely anywhere in the boys hostel and boys can also go anywhere in the girls hostel to hurdes agla sawal hai kya iit ke tag se bhav milta hai to is pe main ye bolna chahunga ki iit ke tag se bhav milta hai bas iit ke gate ke bahar okay hurdes ab next sawal hai kya iit ke tag se ladkiyan bhav deti hain to gurudev आईआईटी के अंदर वाली तो लड़की आपने आपको एमआईटी के समझती है मगर स्कोप पूरा रहता है गुरुदेव है ना स्कोप पूरा रहता है टेंशन उसमें कोई दिक्कत नहीं है और इस सवाल का जवाब मैं एक शायरी से अपनी वीडियो भी एंड करना चाहूंगा कि चिड़िया नेस्ट में मिलती है और मोहब्बत फेस्ट में मिलती है गुरुदेव है ना तो इसी के साथ हम लोग इस वीडियो को विराम देते हैं इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो आई वुड हाईली रिकमेंड यू टू लाइक एंड शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल इट वुड बी ए ग्रेट हेल्प फॉर मी एज वेल सो राधे राधे गुरुदेव फिर मिलेंगे आपसे कुछ दिनों बाद तब तक के लिए शुभरात्रि शुभरात्रि शुभरात्रि